Hello, cultist. Devour released a sneak peek for their new map. Stay tuned to see what's coming to Devour. If you've been following what's going on with Devour, you probably know that the Slaughterhouse was supposed to release in September, just in time for the spooky season. Unfortunately, due to health reasons, two of the developers had to step back from the project for a bit. This was obviously a big blow to the small development team. They've been releasing smaller patches and sneak peeks to keep the community excited about the next big thing in Devour. And that next new thing is the Slaughterhouse. Here's what we do know about the Slaughterhouse. The main nemesis for this map will be Nathan, and this concept art of what he may look like was just released. We also know that his minions will look something like this, although I haven't quite figured out what the bones are for. Developers did tease that these workers might not behave quite as you'd expect based on previous maps. As for the unique map items, we've got a look at a couple of things. First, this item called the Shredder, which looks a lot like a meat grinder to me, obviously plays an important role. These oil cans will also be a part of the new map, as well as these pigs. From what I can tell, it feels like the Shredder is likely where we sacrifice the pigs, similar to how we sacrificed those sweet little goats in the farmhouse map. As for the hint at these vents having a purpose, I'd guess the minions, or maybe even Nathan himself, uses them to get around the map, similar to how Zara used the holes and tunnels in the inn to access different areas. Of course, I have no real way of knowing what the mechanics of the new map will be, but this seems like a plausible theory. How do you think the new map will play? Do you have another theory for how all of this works together? Let me know in the comments. So when should we expect this new map? Sadly, not until after the first of the year, but never fear, Devour has plans for a Christmas event. My guess is that it will be similar to the Halloween event and that it will likely be the same presence from last year with an additional 10 in the new town map. We do know that you'll be able to unlock a terrifying, unique winter-themed outfit for Zara. So watch for that to come in the next few months, and of course, if there are presents, I'll post a guide to help you out. So stay tuned for that. Are you excited for the Slaughterhouse? What other locations do you think developers should consider for future maps? Will you be playing the Christmas event to earn the new Zara skin? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and remember, gaming should be fun.